Wobblies. Welcome to Wobbly Otter Outdoors. I'm Chris and in this video we're taking a quick look at our boondocking bathroom. This episode is made possible in part by generous supporters on Patreon. This certainly isn't a glamorous topic, but having a place to go to the bathroom in privacy is high on the list when a lady's considering going on a camping trip. This is a Browning privacy shelter. We've had it for three years and it's holding up great. You've probably seen it in several of our trip videos and review videos like from last week. And we've also done a video review of it. I'll put a link in the description. Also in the description are links to the products you'll see here. So the Browning Privacy Shelter is what we use for three things, a changing room, a privy, and a shower. So let's look at what we use for the privy. So in addition to the toilet paper, there are basically three parts to our boondocking toilet. One is the luggable loo bucket, which is basically a five gallon bucket with a toilet lid, kitty litter, and double duty bags. There are a couple of sizes of double duty bags. The ones that we use in the demo in this video are the standard or regular size that are in the right of the picture. The ones on the left of the picture are the plus size and they are larger. Both have biogel. Let's look at how it all goes together. The double duty bags have a external bag that is incredibly thick. The external bag has a double zipper closure. The internal bag is black. And inside of it is a powder, a very, very fine powder, just a little bit but there's a fine powder. And what that powder does is react with any liquid and gel it. To put the bag in place, slide it in, fold it over the outside lip, and securely attach the lid. And there's your toilet ready to go. We usually only use the Lego Blue for solid waste. And after going, we sprinkle kitty litter over it until it covers it. The bag will hold about two or three uses. And when you're done, this is the process to close it up. You remove the toilet seat. Fold over the internal bag, push the internal bag down until it clears the top of the external bag. Seal the double zip seal on the external bag and it's ready for disposal in the trash. We got this white bucket and the cool screw top lid to hold the used bags while we're boondocking until we can locate a trash bin. Before using the luggable loo, we were concerned about the potential of flies and odor. We have found that by completely covering the waste with the kitty litter and keeping the toilet lid closed, that we don't have any trouble with odor at all, and there isn't a problem with flies. That's basically how we pack it up for travel, and then it goes in the back of the pickup. The privacy shelter is very well ventilated. It has four vents basically covering the entire top, and then it has windows on either side. Let us know in the comments below what you do when boondocking. What's Bill's favorite boondocking bathroom? A tree and a shovel. Hey Wobblies, I want to interject something here at the end real quick before letting you go. We want to say a very sincere thank you to our subscribers and all of you who take the time to watch our videos and leave comments. We appreciate you all and thank you so much. Thanks for watching Wobbly Otter. We love you and hope all your tomorrows are bright. Until next time.